welcome to Stellara Craft, a show where we cook, craft, and create all things geektacular. I'm Stellara, and today we are going to be making a viewer submitted crafting idea. We are going to be making a Mario Brothers themed piranha plant planter pot. Say that five times fast. <laughs> oh, but it turned out really cute, and so I'm excited to show you guys how it's done. So, let's get started. For this project, you'll need a flower pot, some green spray paint, paints in red, white, and a couple shades of green and then some paint brushes. Start by spray painting your pot green. The paint that I chose is a paint and primer in one, so it made it really easy to do this in just two or three coats. Just remember, do it in a well-ventilated area. Once your paint has dried, you can go ahead and pull up a picture of a piranha plant and start freehanding it onto your pot. Now the piranha plant is basically just a circle with a triangle cut out for the mouth, so it's really easy to draw right on. Now why I do this in paint as opposed to like a Sharpie or a permanent marker is because if you mess up, then you just use a damp paper towel and you can wipe it off so long as you do it quickly. And if you're like me and once you get going, you decide you want some of the spots of your piranha plant to look like they're going around the edge, then you can just grab a damp paper towel and use that same trick to open up some space. Then go in with your white paint and start making your spots. What's really fun about the piranha plant spots is they're asymmetrical, so have fun with them. Make them look like dinosaur eggs or something cool. Then just go in with your first coat of white paint. While the white paint is drying, I started drawing my piranha plant stem and leaves. And I did this by dipping half of my brush in the light green paint and the other side in the dark green paint. And that gave it kind of a cool textured effect as I was painting. Now go on with your red paint and start filling out the inside. Be very careful around the edges of your white spots and mouth because you don't want them to bleed into each other and make a pink piranha plant. So go in with that, be careful, take your time, and then let your coats dry and apply about three more coats. After four coats, my piranha plant planting pot was ready to plant. <laughs> you guys enjoyed this video if so please leave a thumbs up also hit that subscribe button for more nerdy videos every week and don't forget to share your love by sharing this video on Facebook and Twitter if you guys want to submit your nerdy crafting ideas go ahead and contact me on Facebook or Twitter on Facebook I am Tustalara that's T-E-H S-T-A-L-A-R-A -A -A. and then on Twitter it's at Stellara S-T-A-L-A-R-A I will see you guys next week with another Geektastic video, and until then, goodbye! Cars! Cars, you are being rude! Shh! You're being very rude, Cars. <laughs>